And I was like, oh, no, you're not going to leave this argument. <laughs> We're going to talk this out. I followed him two blocks. <laughs> and he called my mother. I called her mom. He called my mom. Baby, 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 baby. One of the first things she said to me is, I don't want to get married. I'm not going for it. I don't care how fine you think you are, but I'm not taking the medicine. There was no spark. <laughs> I don't know. I think maybe I'm in love with you. And if it don't sound completely crazy to you, call me tomorrow at this number. And he said nothing on the phone. The more time I spent with him, I was like, OK, I can see <laughs> why people spend the rest of their lives with someone. And if it does not feel like that in our marriage, that is not where we need to exist. It doesn't make any sense. I said it too, through sickness and in health, but I did not imagine that that goes beyond her. So when it did and she was dealing with that, I didn't know how to, I didn't know how to help her. I was resentful a little bit in the beginning, like, oh, I quit my career for you and now my name is Ephraim's wife. Every goal that I had ever written down and all of that stuff is ultimately not going to happen. I remember one time sitting down and thinking, I can talk to my husband by text better than I can to his face. It took me like five to six years to say, to relinquish control, but then it took maybe another five years for me to be able to articulate how I was feeling about it. She's really, for me, a system of accountability. I needed her more than I actually knew. We think sacrifice is so painful all the time, and it's not. Sometimes it's just, saying, wait a minute, I'm just not going to make me the number one priority right now. You really can do it all. It just doesn't have to look like everybody else. You just have to right. figure out what works best for us. I think all these lessons have toughened you up. I hope so. <laughs> I used to listen to react. But <laughs> now I listen sometimes not to react at all, but just to be able to know how to love him. Baby, baby.